So tell me about how you came up with the bass. Um, I came up with the bass by, since there's two parts in each um, half inch, so I doubled each number by two. Let me clarify for a second so that I understand your thinking. You said there's half in two. So do you mean there's, can you show me what you mean by that? What I mean by, like, since each of these squares is a half, or the squares is a half inch, that I would just double it. To, are you talking about length, width, height, or volume? Um, I would double it to get the length. Okay, so you're telling me, just so I make sure that I've got it, that if you have one of these cubes, and you're thinking about length, you're telling me I need two of these to make one, you would double it. Yes. So, okay, just want to make sure I'm, I'm clear. So then if you have 10 inches here and you're using half inch cubes, how many cubes do you need here for packing? 20. Okay, how about the width? Do you, get, you agree? I do, but I'm trying to figure out um, if it would be done to the volume of this one and then doubled it if it would equal the same thing as that, but I don't think it would. Okay. I did it and maybe we would have to multiply it by, um, I don't know. Okay, so let me back you up to this part. If you want to go about comparing them based on the cubes, what do you know about this length if you're packing with one half inch cubes? That 10 inches is going to be double the 20 inches. Okay. What about this? Okay. Can you find the base layer that way? And once you find the base layer, can you use the base layer to find the volume and then compare? Okay.